hey, what's up now very interesting uh, subject is canceling while running so canceling a thunk while running if you want to cancel your running thunk before it was finished you can use the abort method of the promise returned by this code so remember dispatch will return the same thing returned from the action creator you pass to it and since we are passing a thunk action creator to return a promise and that promise containing the abort function and they have the same exact example that I wanted to use so remember that I am um, when I click on a specific tag tab and go to another tab I want to like abort that promise that had been or that action that had been dispatched here so I now went and fished the dashboards then I just suddenly clicked on the users I want to abort the dashboard uh, thunk but now it's not working like that which is uh, which is pointless because now I just uh, I am on the users tab but the dashboard thunk have been fulfilled and updated the state without I mean no one benefited from that it's just extra work with no reason so yeah and just remember we have delay six seconds in our backend so yeah that's why it's very slow here so let's just continue reading and uh, yeah so after a thunk have been has been cancelled in this way it will dispatch and return uh, this action creator which means that re the rejected reducer will be called uh, with an error message that this thunk had been uh, aborted and uh, yeah so let's do it I will comment this out for your reference so to do it you will just store the re retained promise from here from this thing here and I will return from the use effect another function that called this and this by the way will be equal to component will unmount so it's just like the life cycle uh, functions so this will be called when this component will unmount from the DOM which means I just changed the tab right if you want, if you go to our app.js we have these conditions we'll remove them from the DOM based on the selected tab so this is exactly what I want so I will abort this uh, func when this component will be removed from the DOM that's exactly it so let's just click here and yeah the delay will help us reason about it so I'm now on the dashboard I have dispatched the pending let's now go to the users so now the users thunk is pending but the dashboard is rejected the dashboard thunk of course and if uh, now that users data thunk have been uh, refilled but if you go to the rejected for the dashboard you will see the error messages have been aborted so this is the actually use case that you want to have in this kind of scenario it's very nice and it's very uh, like powerful we are, we are doing something that I think in the normal maybe in just like without this API it will be hard like just writing this logic by yourself it will be hard so yeah I think this is very nice so this is cancelling uh, while running so the next two things are a little bit hard so but I will of course do them and uh, show you some examples and uh, yeah that's it and there is a code for this there is a repo for this code uh, the link in the description and uh, thank you and bye